Hello, this is Jake. I'm a special guest on MacHeads 101. This is going to be my third Java tutorial, and I'm going to be doing this one on user input. So, let's open up Eclipse. Alright, so, in the last tutorial, we made variables, like int i equals 10. And in the program, I assigned it a value of 10. Now, what we're going to be doing here is we're going to be assigning variables the value of whatever the user is going to input. So in order to do that we have to get the scanner and we don't already have that so we have to import it. So to do this we type import java.util.capital S scanner semicolon. And if I wanted everything from util I would just do dot asterisk but I don't need everything since I'm only going to be using the scanner from it, so scanner. Alright, so what we're going to be making here is a program that asks the user to enter their name and then it's going to store that name in a string variable and then it's going to output hello plus that string. So it'll be like enter your name, Jake, hello Jake. Alright, so first I'm just going to make a prompt so they know to enter their name. Already went over this stuff, so. Actually, I'll make that print because I don't want them to print it on the next line just because. It doesn't really matter though. So, next thing we have to do is create a string to store that name. Alright, so now that we have that, we're going to start getting to the meat of this tutorial. Um, to use a scanner, we have to create a scanner object. So, you, to do this, you type capital S scanner, and you can name whatever you want. Scan equals new scanner. And in these parentheses, um, you type capital S system dot in. And really, scanner, scan equals new scanner system in. What that did is it created a scanner object that's going to allow us to get input from the keyboard. Um, so yeah. And that's probably going to be confusing right now, but you'll understand it eventually. And in a few more tutorials, I'll be going in more depth about objects and things like that. So, first thing we're going to do is we do name equals. And what we're going to do is we're going to be setting it equal to whatever they input. So I do scan dot and for strings you just do next and those empty parentheses. So what that would do is it would set I send down to the name and then it would set whatever they entered equal to name. And next for strings it was an integer I do dot next int. Um, dot next double for doubles and so on and so forth but just next is for strings and now system dot out dot print ln hello plus name so I'm just gonna run this to show you what it does so enter your name Jake in here Jake hello Jake see so what that did is it asked me to enter my name when I entered my name I used a scanner object um, to get the input and then I set the name equal to that input then print out hello plus whatever they inputted so that is um, some input for you guys, so see you later.